Hi, my name is Dan. I'm with a company called Triad RV Parts and we specialize in repair parts for RVs. Today we're going to spotlight a product that is a must-have for a, a do-it-yourselfer or someone who's going to do a uh, repair on their RV. This is a test light or a circuit tester from a company called Prime Products and it is one of the best that I have ever seen um, on the market. Uh, now this test light comes with three attachments. Um, it has the uh, hook and stick here for uh, you know going around wire and uh, poking a little hole in it to see if there's current in there. And then it's got two other pointy tips here, well, a shorter one if you're in a real tight space and uh, a longer one if you need to reach in through you know, some location there and deep inside um, some space or area. And then of course it's got a good hardy grounding clip right here which I have uh, clipped to this light over here. Um, uh, and just like most test lights, this one has uh, a light in the handle and it comes on and uh, I'll expose the uh, little tip here and you can hear it. And also you can see the little light coming on, um, you know, and the audio sound. Now, uh, I'm going to go over the reason why I like one, having one of these test lights more than anything. And while I do that, I'm going to change the head. Um, I don't know if you've ever been out uh, at night when it was kind of dark and you were trying to figure out uh, the fuse uh, that might be possibly popped somewhere. Uh, and uh, you have to pull that fuse out and then you have to, you know, figure out if it's good or not and put it back in and that type of thing. But anyway, if you have one of these things right here, you leave that fuse in place. Each one of these things has a little um, exposed part on the fuse at the top. And here and you start, you know, going from one end to the other. And so you come right here and of course you can tell that you got power there. And then you go to the other side of it and so you know that fuse is good. Then you go to the next fuse, right, and you see you have power there, okay? You go to the other side, and you have nothing. And so that fuse is bad. Another reason why this is a great tool for a general RV repair is there is a tremendous amount of 12-volt lines uh, in uh, furnaces and water heaters and that type of thing. And, um, you know, it's just a, it's not somewhat, you know, general common sense. Um, you know, if you've got power going into a circuit board and you don't have power coming out, uh, which you can figure out with this tool, then you know you got a bad board. Um, if you don't uh, have power coming in, then you go back into the camper and you know it's the fuse. You gotta chase electricity. Um, so, and this is a tool that helps you chase electricity. However, you do want to uh, get your wiring diagram out that comes with the water heater uh, and uh, furnace and make sure that you, you are getting a hold of 12 volt lines uh, just to make sure um, you know, if you don't have your uh, paperwork that came with it, then you can probably look it up online, check the model number, serial number uh, from the original manufacturer, and uh, you most likely can uh, figure out which one are 12 volt lines. You know, you can do the very same thing with gas valves. Uh, you can do the very same thing with uh, uh, thermostats, the ones that are mounted on the side of the unit. Well, I hope you've enjoyed our video. Uh, the part we have uh, profiled here is, uh, the part number is SKU1200. And uh, you can find it on our website at www.trvparts.com. And uh, if you've got any questions or comments, uh, feedback about the video, um, you can email me at dan at trvparts.com. Uh, and once again, I hope you enjoyed it, and thanks for watching.